Hey guys, Boris Schlossberg, and today I'm going to show you how to download and install MetaTrader 5 platform. And the journey begins first and foremost with the Pepperstone Secure Client area, where you would just log into the Secure Client login. And once you're there, you can go into your, um, into your accounts tab and request either a new live or a new demo account. I've already requested a new MT5 account. Once you do that, Pepperstone will send you all the details of this particular account, the account number, the password, and the MT5 server URL. All this is important information. I'll show you how to use it. Now, once you've done that, you can go back to your secure client area and go into the downloads section and click the downloads tab. Now, within downloads tab, you're going to see in just one second um, your choices of what you can download. And you can see over here on the bottom, you can download MetaTrader 5 Windows version. And we're definitely going to be using the Windows version. I am right now actually recording this on a Mac, but I am logged in to a Windows VPN. And the reason why is because MetaTrader 5 was designed from uh, the core to be a Windows program. So I'm not quite sure what the functionality is on the Mac program, but I can almost assure you it's not going to be the full functionality. So if you want to use the full benefit of MetaTrader 5, I suggest you run it within a Windows environment for which it was designed for. So we simply click this link, and it's going to just simply send the download into our download folder in my Chrome uh, into Pepperstone Setup 5 EXE. Just double click this, and it will automatically walk you into creating an icon and a Pepperstone, uh, uh, and a Pepperstone program right on your desktop. Then we're going to open up the Pepperstone program, and I'm going to show you how to log in and configure your program. Okay, guys, I've started the MetaTrader 5 but we have not yet logged in and made sure that it's working. And it's the first thing it's gonna do when it's not um, fully activated is gonna ask you, do you wanna open an account? And then once you choose which broker, we're gonna cancel this because we already have um, a specific account and a specific URL that we wanna use. So instead of that, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into file, login to trade account. That's gonna be the function we choose, okay? And if you remember, from my uh, email that I showed you earlier, we can go into our details. Let me just show you the emails. So we go into my email. You see that I have all my details over here. Now I've written them down on a separate piece of paper so I can just walk you through this. But basically, we're gonna mimic all of this information into our MT5 so that we can properly configure it. So now we're gonna go back to MT5 and our account number is 164346, sorry, 346. My password is, they generally give you a very convoluted password, which um, is typical. And then I'm gonna show you how we can change it. 4AQM. Now, the most important part, besides obviously the account and the password, is for you to properly type in, it's important that you type this in, the URL that you see in that uh, MetaTrader 5 server URL. So the URL that I have is mt5-demo. It's all lowercase, as you can see in the um, in that email that I gave you. All right, and we're going to have to go through my horrible typing skills here. Demo 01.pep for stone.com. And we're going to say OK. And we'll, Incoming mail. Oh, look what happened. We are in business. We have um, all the quotes. Now, you can see the reason why we know we're in business, by the way, aside from all of this incoming mail and nice little uh, gee whiz wizardry, is that you're going to get the actual proper market quote on the euro dollar, which right now is trading 1394 by 1394 um, in our trading system. So, um, remember I told you that the uh, password they give you is very convoluted? and it's difficult to remember, and you generally really always wanna change your password. So there are two ways to change the password. I'm gonna show you how to do that. Um, one way is within the platform itself. You can go into Tools, Options, and within this Server tab, you'll, it'll say Server, Login, and Password, and it'll have a little Change button over here, and you can click this Change button, and then you'll type in your current password, and then you can change your master password, 
or you can change your investor password. The investor password is something that you can give other people so they can have read-only access to your, to your account. They can't do anything with it, but they can just simply view your activity if they want to do that. However, a much easier way of changing your password is to go into your secure client area, go into your accounts tab, and we're going to go into my demo account, go into the settings, right over here, simply click the settings gear, and it will say change trading account password. You can click on this, and you can change your account password strictly from your uh, website, right over here from your secure client area. So I'm gonna just change my new password, make it call, call it Boris123. I don't recommend you make that your type of password, but you know, this is a demo account, so it doesn't matter, Boris123. Make sure that I got this right. I probably mistyped it, so I'm going to retype it again. Then we scroll down and just hit submit. And now I'm going to be able to log into my MT5 with a very, very simple Boris123 password. Let's do that just to show you how it's done. Okay, guys, remember my, uh, I'm back in my MT5. Remember, um, this is my demo account, and we had that very convoluted password. So right now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just type in Boris123 because I changed that password. I'm going to hit OK. And boom, we're in the account and ready to roll. As you can see, now we're trading, you know, we're coding properly, and we have a live account, and it's ready to trade. That's how easy it is to download, install, and change your password to something you like in MetaTrader 5.